Hello and welcome to another episode of What's Good in Africa this week. I am Izo Samuel. Please like, comment, share, subscribe and also do not forget to turn on the bell notification icon. Our opening text story for the week gives an insight into the booming agricultural fundings in Africa as Kenya AgTech startup iProcure recently secured a sum of 10.2 million US dollars in a Series B funding round. Some of the investors for the round include INP, Novista Ventures, Seniart, and a host of others. Co-founded in 2014 by Stefano Kakoforo, Nicole Galita, Patrick Wanjohi, and Bernard Mangi, iProcure connects agricultural manufacturers and distributors to local retailers through its unique distribution infrastructure. With a market presence in Kenya, Uganda, the B2B company currently connects thousands of agro-dealers to different manufacturers in these countries and boasts of a 16 times year-on-year -year increase within the last four years. Report also has it that the funding will enable iProcure expand its agricultural supply chain platform across the African continent. Still reporting on tech, Nigerian business application and data management solution provider Blue Chip has recently announced the launch of its products and services in Europe. With its presence in Nigeria, Ghana, Zambia, Kenya, and DRC, the recent expansion into the EU market gives the company a good stance and positions it as a good competition for its European counterparts. Co-founded in 2018 by Kazim Towabade and Olomide Soyowombo, Blue Chip is a business application company that is focused exclusively on assisting companies in planning, designing and implementing business solutions and strategies. The company has also been reported to be one of the leading data warehousing companies in Africa with an extensive track record of partnerships with some of the biggest OMEs and enterprises. Now on Africa Achievement, Nigerian student Ifani Alumina has broken a 108-year-old record as he becomes the first African to win the AFX award for young global citizens since its inception in 1914. The young scholar was presented with the award alongside a cash prize of 10,000 USD during the International Youth Day organized by the United Nations Global Communications Department in New York. Alumina, who beat over 500 global contenders, received the award in recognition of his vigorous campaign to end violence against women and girls through proper orientation of boys on responsible behavior. With an ignited zeal to make an impact in his community, Alumina, through the creation of a youth group called Boys Champion, continues to provide a safe space for boys, training them to become a part of the solution to ending societal violence. The African Youth Get up. This is the time to stand up and take up the challenge to contribute positively to society one action at a time. No matter who you are, no matter what you do, be accountable. Remember, the young stars are watching to replicate the aged are relying on us to right the wrongs. It is the best time to act and act right. Be the light, spread the truth, and be the truth. For accountability, 
I'd like to know what positive action you'll be taking today. Please feel free to write them in the comment section. We can do this. We can do this. Our product for the week is the life-saving Kenyan product invention of Roy Alela called Sign.io. The unique product is an ultimate solution to bridging the barrier in communication between deaf and hearing people consists of a set of smart groups produced to convert sign language movements into audio speech in real time. The sign I.O. groups are mounted with sensors that firstly recognize various sign letters and then transmit the data gathered to an Android application where it is then vocalized. The praiseworthy technology invention has received several international recognitions and continues to provide interaction opportunities for the deaf in Kenya and across Africa. The African continent is an incredible place on planet Earth. Known for its natural phenomena, beauty, incredible land resources, cultural diversity, and lots more. We advise that you tighten your seatbelts and get ready for a jolly ride of tourism and edutainment on the roller coaster of African facts and figures. Did you know that Africa is the second largest continent in the world with over 30 million square kilometers in landmarks? Wow! The continent of Africa is richly blessed with about 50% arable land, 33% of the world's diamond reserves, 40% of the global gold reserve, plus 90% of the world's raw materials reserve lies in the crust of our dear continent. It is also a fact to note that Namibia in Africa has the world's richest fish coastline. The continent of Africa also has over 30,000 medicinal herbs that are modified in laboratories by the West. I bet you, you didn't know this. Africa is a blessing and remains the abode of flourishing and infinite resources. Thank you for watching this episode of What's Good in Africa this week. If you have not subscribed to our channel yet, please do so and follow us across all our social media platforms. Remember to be the light. Do have an amazing